Hey everyone, so this is my vanity that you're looking at. You can see it's got the three mirrors and then the drawers down there. And basically I'm just going to be showing you around um, my vanity and um, you know my makeup collection going through all that. So um, we're going to start over here on the um, left side with all my hair stuff and we'll take you through that now. Okay, so this first side is my hair stuff. You can see me in the mirror. Hi! <laughs> Um, this is just where I keep all my hair products, hairspray, mousse, gel, whatever, hair clips, some tissues over here, and then these are all like random things like rubbing alcohol, pressing medium, moisturizers, little samples from Lush, um, some makeup remover back here, um, this is just kind of like everything, oh, that goes for that, <laughs> this is all kind of random stuff, so that's just kind of where I keep it all. This first drawer is just random hair stuff. I got some hair brushes, Q-tips, bobby pins, clips, hair bands. Everything is going to be in here that's just random hair stuff. This second drawer is all hair bands and a little mirror. And then this last drawer down here is very random. Some bags, makeup bags, um, you know, a curling iron holder, a little mini straightener, just really random stuff. Okay, so the second side is for my makeup. You can see I usually put my mirror, depending on what I'm doing, either on this side or this opposite side, so I'll put it over there for now. And um, as you can see, this is my layout. This is what I see every day, and this is how I keep things. Uh, but we'll go through the drawers first. This first drawer is where I keep miscellaneous things. I have um, some boxes, some um, extra moisturizers, empty bare minerals pots, um, some random glitter, some empty um, MAC eyeshadow pots, backups. I keep a lot of backups in here. My contest prizes are in here. Um, just a lot of random stuff. I have my depotting tools, labeling, magnets, um, a brush case, just really random makeup stuff that I don't use um, unless I'm really searching for it. I kind of just throw it in here. The second drawer has a random makeup bag. Um, this is also kind of miscellaneous. I just have like empty MAC bags in here that I need to throw away. I have my baby wipes for taking off makeup. Again, kind of random, nothing really special in there. And then this last drawer is where I keep other random things. I have my, um, my uh, cloths for wiping off makeup brushes. I got some foil for um, uh, depotting eyeshadows. And all my, this is where I keep my palettes um, until I find a better space for them. So I'll go through them at the end. Okay, so this is the first um, part of my vanity, so I keep all my brushes. As you can see, I have my little like Sephora inspired holder. I just kind of created this all from stuff from Michaels. And this is where I keep all my eyeshadow brushes. Um, this is a concealer brush. I have a few random tools over here. Um, a lip liner and an eye eyebrow pencil, eyebrow comb. Tall shadow brushes in the back. Shorter ones in the front. Eyeliner brush. This is all kind of just miscellaneous, um, a miscellaneous mirror from Sephora, oh, that broke, <laughs> but I keep it. Um, my foundation primer that I have out all the time because I use it every day. My little leaning tower of Pisa shot glass, isn't that kind of cute how it leans? <laughs> and um, right now I have hairpins in it to hold my bangs back when I'm doing makeup, um, but I'll fill it with water when I need to use water with any product. So. This is not for drinking while doing makeup, I promise. <laughs> and then this is all my face brushes, um, powder, blush, foundation, whatever. Um, and then a few miscellaneous tools in here because they're easy to le they're easily seen amongst my brushes. So that's there. And then back here I have all my eyeliners, um, my eyebrow pencils. Um, any kind of miscellaneous liners are in here with the color end poking up so I can see what color that is. And I just keep that back there. And over here is where I keep my moisturizers, face, body, and eye. Oops, knocked it over. Just keep that over there. And then over here I have my, um, up here I keep my skin, my nighttime renewal minerals treatment or whatever. And then this is my makeup tower. This is where I keep everything. It's kind of small. I might need to expand eventually. But um, 
it's basically organized how I really like it. So um, it's all from top to bottom. So I'm just going to go through all the individual drawers. I'm going to start at the top, topmost one, and I'm going to work my way down. Okay, this first drawer is all my face stuff. And, um, you know, I don't have much because it's really just only foundation. Um, and I've used the same stuff for years. So this is my Bare Minerals Foundation Fairly Light. This is my Bisque, which is a mineral concealer. My Laura Geller Balance and Brighten, which is I use as an all-over powder, and it looks very similar to a mineralized skin finish and how it's like all swirly, but it's just an all-over powder. And then my um, bronzer, MAC Bronzer and Solar Riche from the Neo Sci-Fi collection. This next um, drawer are all my blushes and cheek products. You can see I have my MAC um, Blush of Youth Beauty Powder, uh, Well Dressed, Peaches, Beauty from um, Bare Minerals, my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Petticoat, and then my NARS Blush in Orgasm. This next drawer are like tools to me, basically. Um, so everything in here is kind of like a tool. Like I consider my Urban Decay Paint Pot, you know, a tool. It's not like an eyeshadow or anything. I have my um, eyelash curler, various mascaras, concealer, um, sharpener, tweezers, um, visine for mixing with uh, pigments or anything, and that's about it for this drawer. My next drawer are all um, eye products that aren't um, MAC shadows or anything like that. So um, I have my Clinique uh, Cream Eyeshadow, Shady Lady um, Eyeshadows, my Benefit Eyeshadows, my um, Benefit Creaseless Cream Eyeshadow, MAC Pigments, um, a depotted NYX pencil, um, Mutiny Pigment, Paint Pot and Perky, Paint Pot and Bear Study, Crystal Sense Gel Liner, and Black Track Fluid Line. This next drawer are all my lip products, and um, as you can see, I kind of got a wide range. Got everything from NARS, MAC lip glosses, Bear Essentials back there, Chapsticks, Maybelline, MAC lipsticks. MAC Dazzle Glasses, See Through Lip Color, um, more Bare Essentials back there. These are all Bare Essentials. Um, Smashbox uh, Lip Exfoliator, and that's about it. But of course, there's always a, a rogue lip gloss, um, you know, hiding in a purse somewhere. And finally, the last drawer, as you can see, my last drawer. Um, this is all like random things that I don't really have like room for or whatever. Um, these are all bare essential shadows that I didn't press because I didn't have a pan for them. An extra little bookie brush. Um, and then these are all double-ended eyeshadow brushes from Bare Essentials. Um, obviously I can't put them in a jar or anything because it'll smash one of the ends. So these are all the little brushes that I just keep in there. And that's it for my tower of makeup. And now on to pa um, palettes. My first palette is, of course, the um, Coastal Scents 88 Matte Shadows. Um, broad range of colors, very well pigmented. There are mattes and shimmers in this, so this is what I recommend um, um, as a first MAC. Um, excuse me, first palette for 88 Coastal Scents. And then I have my Bare Essentials Pressed Eyeshadows. Um, I'm not going to go through all the names because honestly I couldn't really tell you what they are, all of them. They are all labeled though and magnetized, so if I pulled them all up I could tell you. And they all say BE on the bottom for Bare Essentials. This is Flawless Diamond. So that's my first palette. And then this palette are my MAC Shadows. Um, and basically, they're just organized so for, you know, kind of have some flow going to them. But those are my, that's my first palette of MAC Shadows. And then this is my last palette that I'm still trying to fill. And it's just got um, three extra um, in there that I couldn't fit anywhere else. So, guys, um, that's about it. That's about it for my collection. So I hope you enjoyed, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.